So what? This is fun. It's fun to watch uh, Republicans now. They're in power, and it's so easy that even CNN can call these guys out. Uh, uh, so here's a guy named, this guy's name, Ben Ferguson, as Katie Helper said, came out of a coma. And uh, he, he, here he is uh, trying to make the case. John Lewis is saying that Donald Trump isn't a legitimate president and he's all this stuff, which is stupid. I think to say and to do, and I get why John Lewis is saying it, but don't forget that he also sandbagged Bernie Sanders, lied about him, and uh, in in defense of someone who uh, expand, exploded the prison population for African Americans while they gutted welfare. That was the Clintons, okay? And they called black kids super predators that needed to. So John Lewis, I don't know what the hell happened to him. He used to be a hero, and now he's a zero. OK, I'm sorry. All you people. Oh, look what he did in the 60s. Oh, yeah. And now in the fucking 20 whatevers, he's li he lied about a real progressive sandbagged him in favor of that corporatist warmongering fucking racist. Oh, bring him to heel. OK. And they race baited just as hard with Barack Obama. Uh, so here on CNN, watch this. What happens? This is fantastic. Uh, I also think it is unprecedented uh, that a congressman uh, with a stature uh, uh, was able to come out and say, I don't believe Donald Trump is a legitimate president. I cannot imagine the... the First of all, wasn't it the Democrats and Hillary Clinton saying anybody who questions the legitimacy of the president is undermining our democracy? Mm -hmm. Oh, and then Donald Trump wins. Then, oh, I guess it's okay for us. <laughs> and you don't think half the goddamn country sees that? Sees how fucking cravenly hypocritical that is, John Lewis? They do see it. So general opposition to the idea of Trump is just as stupid as the Republicans' general opposition to the idea of Barack Obama. It is stupid because guess what? Donald Trump outlefted Hillary Clinton when it came to banking policy, when it came to foreign policy. He's for get less wars. He's for no war with Russia. And when it came to uh, banking, foreign wars, Where's one more thing? Oh, ph pharmaceuticals. He's saying that they're screwing us. He's saying the pharmaceutical companies are screwing us. So he outlefted her. So pick the issues. If you just uh, 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 oppose Donald Trump because, oh, he's a sexist or this, you're running around with goddamn David Brock, Henry Kissinger, and Bill fucking Clinton, whose DNA is still sprayed on every wall in that goddamn White House. <laughs> so that's why this, that's why it's stupid to do that. You see Bernie Sanders when he goes on the floor and he opposes Donald Trump. He opposes specific policies. That's how you beat him. You highlight the policy. General opposition to Donald Trump because you're somehow morally superior. A is fucking bullshit. Right. Because you're not. You're a bunch of goddamn warmongers. All right, so let's go back to this. So let's. this is fun. This is how bad the Republicans are. Do you see how much they're going to reveal themselves? Even CNN can call them out. All out, the backfire that you would have if a Republican would have ever implied that about Barack Obama or Bill Clinton or, or JFK or anyone else, for that matter. Ben, uh, Ben, that is, Ben, that, Ben, many that's exactly did, what ben. many Republicans <laughs> did, including the president-elect, for years questioning the legitimacy of the first black president, which, by the way, many when, saw... When did, as racist. When did you have when did you have John McCain or any other major congressman come out and say in an interview days before the inauguration that they do not see Barack ben Obama is, as a legitimate president? No, I, no, 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 I want is you to tell me who said hair? that because it is didn't that, happen. It didn't happen. Ben, I'm Bobby, asking not. the questions and, and, and the president elect, <laughs> the president elect did that to the sitting president for years. That's how easy it is. That even a CNN ho weekend host, it looks like. <laughs> I don't know who that is, so I'm going to guess she's a weekender. Can do that. Just that. How stupid did that guy look sitting there? Everyone knows that Trump ran around screaming about he's a birther, birther, birther. Where's his college records? Where's his birth? Nobody just seemed to smell. <clears throat> so, uh, again, this is a gift <clears throat> to the Democrats that they get to run against such fucking craven morons like the republicans who don't have a goddamn idea in their whole goddamn party let's what let's see how the democrats fuck it up this time bob <laughs> hey we're doing another live jimmy Dore show january 30th 
That's a Monday night, 8 p.m. in Burbank, California. There's a link for tickets right underneath here. Click on the link. We'll see you January 30th for the next live Jimmy Dore show. Mm -hmm.